Assalamu alaikum guys, welcome back to Civil Engineers YouTube channel. What is the standard dimensions for bedroom, master room, dining room, TV lounge, kitchen, bath, water closet? Because many people they want to construct their house but they don't know the standard size of various rooms and building. So therefore, every civil engineering student and architecture should be know the standard size of different rooms and building. So therefore, this video is very important for non-civil engineering people and also for civil engineering students or for architectures to know about the standard size of various rooms and building. So therefore, today we will discuss building planning and drawing especially for size of various rooms of residential building. Guys, this is for residential building. That's why because many architectures, I saw them, they can uh, draw a good planning. They can do good planning in house uh, uh, for residential house or building, but they don't know the standard size. So the standard size are very important. So you should know about the standard size. With standard size, according to standard size, you should start uh, the room uh, size okay so let's start guys first of all uh, if you uh, didn't like this video so must like the video and subscribe the channel with press bell icon if you are new on this channel press bell icon is important when I upload any video to this YouTube channel so you will get get notification first if you pressed the bell icon right let's start the topic is size of various rooms of a residential building so guys here the first one is but the size uh, which I which I am discussing in this video this size is our uh, different size should be in millimeters okay and if you want to convert to meter so you will uh, divide by 1000 that's why because 1 meter is equal 1000 mm 1000 millimeters okay so therefore you can convert from the millimeters to meter you should divide that number by 1000 it will give you meter if you want to get fit okay so uh, in one fit we have 300 millimeters so that should be divided by uh, millimeter should be divided by three uh, 300 mm then it can give you fit okay so this is the formula to change from millimeter to fit and to change from to convert from a millimeter to meters so here the first one is uh, drawing room or living room. So what should be the standard size? So the standard size of the drawing room is 4200 mm. This is its width. So the first number is width. Okay, this is width. And the second one is its length. Okay, the second number is length. So don't be confused here so here the living room size is 1200 millimeters so this is uh, sorry uh, 4200 millimeter this is 4200 mm okay if you want to convert it so it become 4.2 meter okay and its length is its length is uh, 4800 millimeters okay length is 4800 mm okay which become 4.8 meters okay this is its uh, I convert it to 4.8 meters okay from 4800 millimeters so this is the standard size but this is the small okay it should not be less than this if guys uh, you can also get this one uh, 5800 mm or uh, by uh, 7200 mm right this is the larger and this is the smaller it should not be less than 4800 mm by 40, uh, 42, 4200 mm sorry by 4800 mm two so you can also take dimensions of our size of living room between these video okay r2 5800 mm by 
7800 mm okay means 5.8 meter by 7.2 meter okay so between this you can take 4.2 meter by 4.8 meter so between 4 uh, 4 uh, 4.8 meter and 5.8 meter so you can take between these okay now guys the second one is for bedroom okay for bedroom and also for master room you can keep this size which is 300 3000 millimeter okay 3000 millimeter by 3600 millimeter or you can also take this one 4800 millimeter by 4800 4200 millimeter by 4800 millimeter or 4.2 meter by 4.8 meter or 3.6 meter by 3 meter okay between these two you can take anyone but it should not be less than 3 meter by 3.6 meter and this is the larger one 4.2 meter by 4.8 meter okay for bedroom the other one is guys dining room and the dining room size should be 3600 millimeter by 400 4200 mm two you can also take this one if this one is not suitable for you so you can also take this one 4.2 meter by 4.8 meter this one also same like this one this is for dining room guys the other one is kitchen kitchen is very important uh, uh, in building so therefore many people they are uh, confused uh, the size of the kitchen especially uh, non civil engineering people and many civil engineering students uh, they comments in comments box they are telling me sir tell me the standard size of the kitchen so guys the standard size of the kitchen is 2500 mm by 3900 mm it should not be less than this but between these two you can take with this 3000 mm by 3000 mm okay so it was 300 so sorry for that 3000 mm okay so are 3 by 3 meter okay are 2.5 meter by 3.9 meter okay the width should be 2.5 meter minimum okay and uh, uh, it uh, length should be 3.9 meter so the first one is width and the second one is its length right now guys come to the bath and water closet combined if you want to use bath and water closet combined so the size should be 800 mm by 800 mm or 1800 mm by 2500 mm you can convert it to meters because i've already discussed here in one meter we have 1000 mm bath separate if you want to uh, construct or if you want to make bath separate so the separate bath size should be 1200 mm by 1800 mm okay for separate bath and for separate water closet separate water closet because these are bath and water closet are combined here in this one but after these two are separate so the water closet should be 1200 mm by 1200 mm now the other one is guys guest room so the guest room size should be 300 mm by uh, 3000 mm by uh, 3600 mm these are the standard guest room size okay guys the last one is store room where you want to store something uh, which are uh, actually we are using uh, in house so, so if there are extra some things so we can store in store room so the store room size should be okay it's also depend on you because uh, uh, if you have more materials extra materials so for that you can take uh, the larger size but the normally size you can use 2500 mm by 2500 mm to 300 mm by 300 mm uh, which can facilitate you in house so guys uh, these are the some standard size of uh, various rooms which we are using and building are in house especially in residential building so it's important for non civil engineering people if they don't know about uh, uh, technical work of civil engineering so it's also important for non civil engineering people especially for architecture designer and those civil engineering students uh, 
uh, which comments and comments box so this is also specially for them guys if you have any question related with this topic so you can comments i will try to reply your answer but you should remember the size which i have discussed so thanks for watching see you in next video goodbye